Tyler, what was the key to you being so efficient tonight and allowing you to go seven? Um, I don't know. I mean, my my slider was below average all game. Um, and, I mean, I guess I located my fastball and split pretty well to get some, especially with the split, to get some uh, early uh, contact. So, uh, yeah, I have, to, I have to say fastball split was... Uh, what uh, was able to, you know, get me through seven. Can you take us through the, the seventh inning? You got the leadoff hitter from Hampson, and then uh, what was the mindset as you retire the next three guys? Um, I mean, just try to make some pitches. Um, honestly, um, was just trying to make pitches to uh, Diaz, and he flew out to right. And I thought I thought Hampson was going to go; he could run a little bit, but he didn't. Um, and I was like, okay, um, we can we we can work with this. And then and, um, Blackman came up, and I was honestly I want him to pop one up either in the infield or shallow uh, shallow in the outfield. And um, you know I was able to make three good pitches to strike him out, and then and then. Um, with Tapia, I just needed to make a pitch to get to get now. So this is the, I believe, the seventh extra inning win for this team. Uh, really gutting it out tonight. What's it say about the, the guys in that clubhouse winning a game like tonight? Um, a couple things. Um, obviously, um, we can get that runner in. So, so the hitters are doing their job, and then the bullpen um, coming in and and not allowing that run to to score. Um, is is huge, and we've been able to do that a lot. So, so both sides have been just awesome at extra innings. Thank you, Tyler. Yeah. You mentioned your slider wasn't where you wanted it today, but what helped you? To, you, you had a stretch where you got 12 or 13 in a row leading into that seventh inning. Just what helped you kind of navigate those when you don't have your slider like that? Uh, just the other two pitches. Um, I think um, I got I got lucky with with my slider today um, when I wasn't giving up a giving up a home run or or a two strike uh, base hit. Um, I was able I was able to get some outs with it, but um, but yeah, I mean just just having the other two pitches was huge today. What was it like just watching the, the relievers behind you, Anton? You know, Sims gave up the two-run hit, but able to send it to the 12th uh, Embry at the end. Yeah, they've been awesome. Um, um, I, I, and I didn't know too much about Heath, um, you know, before he came on, on our team, but he's been outstanding. And then, and then um, TJ is one of the best pitchers in baseball right now. Um, and not just right now, just flat out, he is. He's like, I, there's no other way to put it except he's just absolutely nasty. And then same goes with Sims. Um, they both, all three of them are just. Um, I wa sit back and watch their stuff, and I'm just like, man, like if I could throw a slider halfway as good as any of these three guys, like, like I would be so happy. But uh, no, they're they're awesome, yeah. One All more of question, them guy. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, no, you're good. One more question, guy. Good. Just in the uh, top of the seventh, did you did you have any fear? I guess that you were going to get pinch hit for just the situation, first and second, two outs. Um, even though your pitch count was low. A little bit, um, just because we needed a win today. Um, uh, was there a runner on? Two runners on? I'm not sure, but um, yeah, I was walking up there. Um, I didn't look initially, and I just started walking up, and no one said my name, and I was kind of like peeking, like, hey, like, you guys going to stop me or not? And they didn't, so, um, yeah, I was, I was pretty surprised just because the situation, um, you know, said probably, um, you know, a uh, pinch hit for me right there, but, uh, but I'm, I'm grateful that uh, I didn't. Thank you, guys.